and once we keep adding buttons you can see that it continues to go from top to bottom in this video I will be showing you how to use linear layouts I recommend this video for beginners because this is not going to be an in in depth video but this is just going to be for beginners for starters just learning Android studio let's get right into it so what I'm going to do first is move this to the side but not too much to the side so I don't block out the folders but I do this because it gives me a bigger space to work with next we're gonna go over to activity main which is right here and this hello world text usually it'll be right here but what I want you to do is delete it I'm going to delete it so what we're gonna do is go to layouts and we're gonna bring down linear layouts you can place it anywhere you want it's just gonna be on the whole screen so now what is a linear layout basically it just puts everything in a linear layout it can be either vertical or horizontal I'll show you how to do this but first let me put some constraints and to do that you can just press this what this does is it ties it like it gives it constraints so it just don't be all over the place all right to show you how this will look like I'm going to go for the vertical the vertical linear layout as you can see if we go right here vertical is just top to bottom linear is side to side now I'm gonna go grab a button and place it right here and as you can see the button is at the top and once we keep adding buttons you can see that it continues to go from top to bottom this is linear layout and if you want to go to horizontal layout easy way that I like to do is to go to split and you're going to highlight where linear layout starts with the arrow and the closing tag that is at the bottom you highlight it you just press backspace or delete and it goes away now we're gonna head over back to design and we're going to use the horizontal layout right here and we're just gonna place it in the layout now we're gonna use buttons just gonna grab a button place it under and in your head you might be wondering mass programmer why is it going from top to bottom I thought you said it'll be horizontal from side to side and yes it is now look if I just add another button you can see that it adds a button to the side you just add another one and it keeps adding and it keeps adding if you enjoyed this tutorial, I recommend that you go on my channel and look at my other tutorials. Congratulations, Mass Programmer Route.